Hello everybody out there, how's it going? My name is Tegizzle and welcome back to another Discord video. This is actually a follow-up to my how to add a bot to your Discord server video. Now of course that video has been extremely popular and a lot of people have found it very useful on how to get a bot added to their servers. Especially the very popular bot Athex which I recommended in that video. A big concern I've noticed though ever since I've uploaded that video is that people's bots are offline, especially Athex, and they're wondering how to get them back online. In this video, I'm actually going to explain what's going on with that whole situation there and actually what you can do about it. So firstly, I want to explain what happens when a bot goes offline. Really what's going on there is the bot is going offline, not just from your server, but from every server for the most part that it's a part of. Because what happens when you invite a bot to join your server, you're not actually adding it to your server or your computer. It's actually being run on a separate computer on a separate server, not related to you whatsoever and just joining your Discord server just like anybody else would. It's just a member of your server, and it has certain functions because you give it the privileges using the server settings. Now, when it goes offline, that means something's going on on the back end with the bot. So the creator or whoever hosts the bot is either working on it with updates or they're having some server issues, and there's not really a whole lot you can do to get it back online. The only thing you can do at that point is check on why it's offline to begin with with updates from the creator if they post them because many of these creators of these bots don't actually have twitters for their bots or any direct feed so it's really only accessible for the bots that actually put put the information out there in athex's case there's actually an official discord server where you can get information on why the bot is down and even get tech support with athex as a matter of fact i have the link right here for athex's official website and right here you can find a link to join the official discord server which we will go to right now now over here is the actually frequently asked question section of Athex. And actually I'm going to read to you one of the parts that's probably the most relevant here. Help. Athex is offline on my server slash not responding to commands. A shard, aka a group of servers, has likely gone down. Please be patient as I likely know about it and will restart the shard as soon as possible. So as you see right there, the creator of Athex knows about this and is working on it when it happens. So at that point, whenever the bot is offline, you're waiting for it to come back, what do you do? You can just get some more bots in your server. There are hundreds, if not thousands of bots available for you to add to your server. Actually over here on the right hand side of my Discord server, the, the Tegizzle Discord server, you can see right here that Athex is offline. But that's just one bot of many in my server. At this moment, I'm currently using Aerosbot, which I don't use a whole lot personally in my server because I have really great mods and a lot of people are already kind of take care of most of the stuff in my server. But in case I ever need the extra backup, I got Aerosbot here, does a lot of moderation stuff, and is overall a very solid bot for most general Discord use. The Nightbot here is really meant for Twitch streamers that use Nightbot in their Twitch chat. So not really too useful unless you're a Twitch streamer that uses Nightbot. And then I actually have OXYL or Oxel here. I'm not sure if it's actually called Oxel, but I assume so because it sounds cool to me. But Oxel here, or OXYL, plays music. And because I know a lot of people use Athex to play music in their servers, this is the best go-to music bot at the moment that I've seen and my friends are using it in their servers as well. One more thing I want to put out there by the way is a big reason why Athex has had a lot of trouble is because so many people are actively using it. It's probably more than likely the most popular bot. From when I when I last checked it has the most users and the most servers it's a part of. So it's definitely best that you guys add multiple bots to your servers and maybe kind of try to spread the load out a little better because when everybody's trying to go to the same bot, these guys are just independent people who are making these bots trying to provide us free services with them so keep that in mind and be patient with these people but if you guys have any more questions comments or concerns about discord or bots or anything that you think i might know about please leave them down in the comment section below i will definitely read them i read all the comments and if you guys have any recommendations for bots that you think will work for people or will work for me or anything else let me know and let the uh, let the community know here because you guys are really wonderful about letting each other know what's going on in the comments. I've seen lots of people on all my videos help each other out. Also, keep in mind, I'm going to uh, leave a link in the description to find more bots. So if you guys don't like the ones I recommended, I'll actually show you a great place to find all of the bots that I basically find them at. And of course, if you need any help with Discord, I also have a full guide on actually how to use Discord on creating your own server and setting up Discord for your personal use, which will also be available in the description. So thank you guys. I have been Tigizzle, and I'm going to be signing off. And please feel free to join the Discord server for Tigizzle down below. Bye-bye.